Central New York. It's the Chiefs and the Jets on Sunday night primetime. The unmistakable New York skyline to the east. And we are across the river on the Jersey side at MetLife Stadium in East Rutherford. Coming up, one game to decide who represents the AFC in the Super Bowl. It's the Kansas City Chiefs and the New York Jets. The stadium is packed. Standing room only a chance for their hometown team to get to the Super Bowl. Great to have you with us, Mike Tirico, Greg Olson, and the most important thing in the building, the Lamar Hunt Trophy. It is up for grabs for the AFC. For the right to represent the AFC in this year's Super Bowl. Off we go on EA Sports. He'll be brought down right around the 25-yard line. So out comes the Kansas City offense to take over for the first time. And there is the guy at the top of the game, Patrick Mahomes, their quarterback. We talked to him earlier in the week, Mike, and he tried to downplay this as just another game. But I think after seeing him on the field during warm-ups, that's gone out the window. You can tell it's starting to set in just how big of an opportunity this really is. They've outlasted every team in the AFC, except for the one they're about to face. And if they're able to beat them, man, they'll have a chance to do something really special. But for that to happen, they're going to need him to lead the way as they try to overcome this intimidating atmosphere. And if he does that, they could be holding the Lamar Hunt Trophy in just a few short hours. Third down and nine. Throwing from the gun. Here's Patrick. That is hard. He gets the hook up with Rice. His first catch here in this AFC title game, and it's a first down. From the shotgun, it's Mahomes. And he can't hang on through the contact. It's incomplete. What a good job defensively to meet him just as the ball was arriving. And it'll be second down. Now Mahomes gives it to Pacheco. Now a loose football. And as you can see with that fumble, Mike, it really just goes back to the fundamentals of how they're taught to carry the ball. And they talk about the points of pressure. And the biggest thing really, Mike, is you want the front tip of the ball the part where your fingers cover, to always be higher than the back tip of the ball. So often you see that front tip go down, and it makes it so much easier for that defender to kind of rake it out. So you want pressure against the outside of the ball, both tips, the inside of the ball, and then keep that front point up. Now, faking the give. That pass sideline is caught. Nice catch. Stays in bounds. And he's got the first down. Terrific job with the feet to make that one a grab. Tight end going in motion here. They'll throw out of the gun. A high throw there, but a nice job to go up and get it. Down at the 12. It's first and 10. The red zone now. He'll drop to throw. That is hot. What a job to keep the play. His drive will start on the ground. Tough to bring down. And somehow he manages to get four yards out of that. Back to the ground. He'll get it again. And he'll be brought down up around the 38-yard line. They're trying to work quickly here and put the pressure on the defense. He'll work forward for a couple with Justin Reed up from the safety spot to make the stop. The offense in hurry-up mode, pushing the pace. Escaping the danger, throwing and completing. 
And he is out of bounds, but not until he's inside the 40-yard line. First and 10 now from the 36. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. He keeps it himself. Good decision to take off. He gets 15 yards and a first down. On play action, he'll set up to throw. A hit as he throws there. It's going to wind up incomplete. The pressure got to him that time, and it'll set up second down. Moss in motion. Back to the air again on second and 10. And he's in. Both teams ready to go once more as the kicks away this one taken at the seven he'll work his way across the 25 yard line the Jets offense and their running back getting ready to go back to work they've opened up a big lead already trying to put this one to bed maybe before halftime another drive starts here with first and ten this is a great example here of just not getting too complicated as an offensive coordinator. Who's one of your best players on the field, and how do you get... Oh, big hole, left side. And he's got another one. Touchdown, Jets. Saving his best for the playoffs. His third touchdown of the game. And the show continues. What a first half he's had, Greg. A third touchdown pass with that one. Mike, what stood out to me the most so far is just the amount of space these guys have had to operate in. I think if I'm this defensive coordinator, me and my staff at halftime are revisiting this game plan. They obviously felt good. At hey, street, street. Hey. Right away, they'll set up to throw. Quick hitting slant there. And they'll move this one down inside the 40-yard line. He'll try and hurry to the line here. He'll drop to throw. They go sideline, and he stays in bounds. Got the feet down in time. It's a first down. First down. First down, at the 20-yard line. Let's go now. Slot receiver headed right. From the shotgun, it's a give up the middle. Uh-huh. And the Jets are going to have a first and goal. Very nearly a touchdown. He's going to be marked out of bounds just shy of the pylon. Here we go, set. Throwing now from the gun. To the end zone there, but it is incomplete. This crowd... Hope the previous play is under review. So the challenge is unsuccessful, and he's going to have to be careful here because he has just one challenge for the remainder of the game. He'll try to run this one in. Powering forward. Huddled up and taken down. They got him. He'll try to go up tempo here as they hustle to the line. Down the field, it's caught on that left sideline. And he will score. They do try to run it out as they start on the ground. And he does not want to go down. Somehow he turned that into a gain of six. This just shows why you can't count on just one guy to take him down. He's a powerful enough runner. You gotta have guys coming in support when that first hit is made. It takes a team effort to stop him, especially once he gets going. Now he'll air one out. That's going to wind up incomplete. Not much time remaining. Time for one more snap here in this first half. Here's a third down and four. They'll look to throw. He's going to try it here again. 
and that is brought in. And he's going to take this into the end zone. Sensational play for the moment. There's a marker down. I don't think he's going to like the result of this flag. Oh, just a terrible feeling. The penalty wipes out that long touchdown. Back to throw. Fires left sideline. That is complete. And he's going to be brought down inside the 15. Teams kind of nurse these big leads, Mike, especially as the game unfolds. They turn to the ground game. They try to slow everything down. Well, not this offense. They refuse to take their foot off the gas. They're still mining for explosive plays. And frankly, with the way today's gone, I don't blame them. They'll throw here on third and short yardage. And he's taken down inside the opponent's 35. Back to the air one more time. That is hauled in at the five. And he will down. They got him. This offense moving quickly, and they'll try to get set. Going up top. And he's got it. A great connection there. They're going to bring it down inside the 35-yard line. They'll try to set up the screen here. Yeah! <laughs> he's still on his feet. And he's into the end zone yet again. Touchdown, New York. Save me. It is incomplete. Very good job defensively. Stayed right with him. And will bring up third down. Taking off, he'll try to get there. And he's out of bounds, but they're going to spot this inside the 25. First and 10. That is caught. What a throw. They'll begin here on the ground. He's got room at the 30. And they will finally get him down, but not before he's able to take this up near the 40-yard line. He'll get rid of it and complete it. And they're going to work this down inside the 45. Now off the bootleg, he'll look to throw here. He's going to look for the home run ball. He's got another one. Touchdown, New York. Saving his best for the playoffs. His third touchdown of the game. They continue to add points. Greg, very interesting. These days, that's just too easy. You've got to secure that interception for your defense and get off the field. Now, this looks like a design run. Into space. He's inside the 30. And he's going to go all the way. An electrifying run. 83 yards. On the set. Set. Here's a handoff out of the gun. Boom. Whoa. And he's out of bounds. Mark him down right at the 10-yard line. So a big one there to start the drive. A pickup of 44 yards. And he will score again. So the kickoff team out there one final time in the final minute as they kick it away. Here comes a return from the five. And he'll be brought down past the 25. Decent field position to start this drive. They'll break the huddle. 
Coming up now for first and ten. Now a handoff, running right. Still fighting, what a run. Shedding tacklers. Picks up nine on the play. Going for it all. And this one is pulled in. What a grab. And this is going to be a touchdown in the win column for the Jets. As they will lift the Lamar Hunt Trophy, they are off to the Super Bowl in two weeks as champions of the AFC.